'twas the night before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The traps were all set by the chimney with care, in hopes that Saint Exterminator would soon be there. The roaches were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of insecticides danced in their heads, and Mama in her fly swatter and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday objects below. When what to my wonder my eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny spiders there. With an old little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be Saint Tick. More rapid than roaches his course they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now cockroach, now bedbug, now termit and flea. Oh mosquito, oh spider, oh ant and wasp you see. To the top of the porch, to the top of the wall. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they met with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop the coursers they flew, with a sleigh full of traps, and Saint Exterminator too. And then in a twinkling I heard on the roof the scratching and scurrying of each tiny hoof. As I drew in my head, and I turned about, down the chimney Saint Exterminator came with a bound. He was dressed in all white, with his, from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ash and soot. A bundle of traps he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler, just opening his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry! His cheeks were like roses, and his nose like a cherry. Uh, his droll little mouth was drawn like a bow, and the beard on his chin was white as snow. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work, and filled all the traps, then turned with a jerk, and lay his finger upon his nose, and giving a nod, up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they flew, like down to a thistle, and I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight, Happy Christmas to all, and to all a pest-free good night.